the best transformations in the game LEGO Marvel Super Heroes 2. Venom has one of the best transformations in the game LEGO Marvel Super Heroes 2. He is in the small version and stays in his most powerful and large version. The transformation is scary. His transformation into small Venom is also very good. I should have been a knight. Let those fellas get all the Amadeus chose Hulk is in the game LEGO Marvel Super Heroes 2. He is the Hulk with the top knot. After transforming he does some bodybuilder poses, a reference to Lou Ferrigno. His detransformation doesn't leave anything to be desired either. Another giant in the game LEGO Marvel Super Heroes 2 is Rick Jones. He transforms into this super cool and unique blue giant. I really liked playing with him because he can become invisible. Groot has one of the best transformations in the game LEGO Marvel Super Heroes 2, as he goes from the baby Groot version to a big Groot, very reminiscent of the one from the film Guardians of the Galaxy, he even makes a protective shield like the one in the film. Fin Fong Fum is one of Iron Man's enemies, he is already big in the game and can get even bigger, his transformation consists of increasing the size of this dragon, he can even fly. This transformation in the game LEGO Marvel Super Heroes 2 for me is one of the best. Tony Stark gets rid of his armor and gets another armor. Then he looks for it and it scares him. An armor that has a style in Model Prime Armor 51. Old Tony Stark also has a very different transformation when he puts on Iron Man's armor as this character arrives out of nowhere and starts throwing pieces at Tony Stark's body. The Sandman's transformation is something very particular, since the game LEGO Marvel Super Heroes 1 he has this type of transformation, here he transforms into a sand cannon, which can be very useful in combat. Also in LEGO Marvel Super Heroes, the symbiote Spider-Man has a transformation into Peter Parker. He leaves the scene and returns as Peter Parker. Spider-Woman has a transformation similar to Spider-Man. She leaves the scene and returns to Gwen Stacy, but she knows how to play the drums. This is certainly the most unique transformation in the game LEGO Marvel Super Heroes 2. Ego the planet, Star-Lord's father actually transforms into a kind of planet in the game. It's not very good to play with him, but the transformation is very good. Now we have the transformation of Ant-Man who transforms into the size of an ant. Something like the movies, this Ant-Man outfit is the same as the Marvel movies. Besides, it can also be in a giant version in the game, which is very interesting. Also in LEGO Marvel Super Heroes 2 we have Killmonger, Black Panther's enemy, he has the same transformation as in the film. Now we have this character who I don't particularly know the name of but who has a very good transformation. He has these skills with fire, he can also fly. Another good transformation is that of this character who can summon a horse with wings. That big green fella. No, not 
Hulk, the other one. Apparently, he's been causing a bit of a ruckus around here. He needs to watch himself before he makes too many enemies. Starting with the Wasp, it transforms into its small but very powerful version as it can shoot these rays from its hand. It is one of the character's most beautiful outfits. She can fly and she can also become giant. This is another character who has similar powers. I don't know the name, but he has a really cool and different outfit. He can shrink and become super giant. Howard the Duck is in the game LEGO Marvel Super Heroes 2, and has one of the best transformations in the game. He has this look that is very reminiscent of Iron Man's bitterness. He can jump high and changes his clothes. The classic Ant-Man also has a good transformation in the LEGO Marvel Super Heroes game. He can become small, use attacks with ants, and best of all he can become giant. His clothes are very good and reminiscent of the classic comics. Starting with Ant-Man, this is the film version. His uniform is the same as the ones in the films. He basically has the same transformations and abilities as the classic Ant-Man, but the clothes are much cooler and more modern. The Wasp is the one from the Uck movie too. She has a much better uniform than the classic Wasp and has the same abilities and transformations as the classic Wasp. Ms. Marvel is also in the LEGO Marvel Super Heroes game. She has this classic uniform, and basically her transformations allow her to become giant and stretch her arms and legs to attack. She can also become a giant and small version and can do a kind of balloon with your body. That crazy fashion designer was... Also in LEGO Marvel Super Heroes we have the Giant Man. He is very similar to Ant-Man. He can become giant and he can also become tiny. This character who I don't know the name of, but has a really cool transformation. She can fly and has a very good look. Her powers and abilities are unique and great when using them to battle and complete missions. Now in LEGO Marvel Super Heroes 2 we have Ant-Man's daughter. Do they call her Ant-Woman? The good thing is that she has similar clothes to Ant-Man's, but with different colors. She has the same abilities and transformations as Ant-Man, being able to become super big and super small. Continuing on LEGO Marvel Super Heroes 2 we have Dormammu, he has this transformation of becoming giant. But what impresses is his look. He even looks like the Ghost Rider. He has skills with fire and can fly. Now we have this character who is a mix of Thor and Iron Man. He can fly thanks to his wings and his transformation allows him to become super giant, one of the best looks in the game. We also have Yellow Jacket. He has this super different look and has the same transformations as Ant-Man, being able to become big and small. To finish, we have another look of the Wasp that basically has the same transformations as the previous Wasps, but a very beautiful look. Starting with the Hulk, he has a good transformation, but I preferred the transformation from the previous game, but this one leaves something to be desired. Another Hulk that also has in the game is the Gladiator Hulk. This one has a very cool transformation because first he pulls out his weapons and then transforms. The look of this Hulk is very good. It's also cool to see the transformation from Hulk to Bruce Banner. Another Hulk that is in the LEGO Marvel Super Heroes game is the Red Hulk. Here we have General Ross and he transforms into Hulk. The look of this Hulk is very good, in addition to the attacks that he plays with fire. <laughs> 